Hey there, everyone. The Sao Cow playing Super Mario Galaxy, believe it or not. Alright, yesterday we super completed a late level, so I feel like today I should be a good boy and do some purple. So we're gonna go to the kitchen and find a purple there. And then I guess we'll see what happens. Alright, and now I know that you can just jump up these bookshelves and it's a lot faster than going all around. Like, yeah, you don't get the... What am I not getting? It's not like I'm grabbing any of the one-ups on the way, because they're kind of in the way. And here, I cannot... Okay, you know what? This would have been faster if I could you jump on command. Still have trouble with that. Alright, so... Kitchen zone place. Alright, so very clear. Yeah, like, you need a purple, you need a purple. The thing below is a small one, right? Purple, no. It's so... Okay, so there's only two big galaxies here still. Alright, well, whatever. I'm getting distracted. Just... The way this game is organized sometimes is just very odd to me. Oh, we're gonna be swimming again? Hey, you know what? You know what? We swim sometimes. <laughs> That's what we do in a game. I mean, I feel like beach combing for purple coins. I feel like, yeah, if you're gonna make a game about space, I think that having the game also be about swimming makes a certain amount of sense. There's some coin that's like way up there. I might have to like blow up a cave underwater or something. All right, well, I mean, let's just get going. This is one of these. I got a shell now. I don't know if I want it, but I got a shell now. Oh, I, I decided I don't want it. Like, it'll come back. I've seen shells. Yeah, look at that. It reappears like, I don't want it. It's, I don't know, it's distracting while I'm trying to move here to go on top of this tree and start this. Well, there we go. No, oh, I should have done that instead. Turn the camera around. Yeah, looking in. God damn it. But like looking in the water. No, there are like a handful of coins in the water. So that's, God damn it. Whatever. I guess I can keep it. Doesn't stop any of my verbs, really. I'm just bad here. I don't know. Okay, I'm on top of the tree. I did it. First coin. Hate. I did it! I got- well wait, fourth? Okay, well I got- you know what I mean. I... I don't know if I can long jump while holding a thing. Then I try- I thought I did what I needed to do to do a long jump, but it didn't long jump, so... I don't know, but maybe I just didn't Z hard enough. Like, it's possible. Because, like, this is clearly all spaced out where, yeah, you can just kind of, like, Z to the next, Z to the Z. Well, here we are, getting things used across to get a look around. There's the captain, he's pretty big. We'll talk to him. It's free time in swim class. Uh, I will play nice. Playing nice and attracting this thing to my hand. Well, uh, oh, that thing is just floating. There is a lot of air to that shell. Don't worry about it. All right. So now what am I doing now? Oh, you can be a sprint. Oh, that's how you get on top. Weird. Uh, so we're just kind of backporting this uh, mechanic, huh? All right. Backporting. Not a correct word, but you understand what I mean. So you know what? That's what matters. All that matters to me is that you understand above the coach's head. Oh, uh, is there something above the coach's head? I can't see the coach from here. I'm too far away. But there's little guy here. And then there's another one. And I got it. Okay, so I was wondering about the, the pipe, you know, that leads to the bonus world. But looks like there's no pipe. So the answer is that conundrum. Man, I just cannot... You. Okay, I think this wall just does not want to be uh, touched. That's fine. I'm a weird spring now. Okay, no, you can just hold a button. But, okay, so you can just hold a button. Okay, I see what, what happens. If you, can't, if you just hold a button, you won't be springing all the time. But you can hold the button at any time after you've pounced. And you will get the big spoing. So hey, look at that, we're learning. Uh, cannot change the camera. 
Why not? Let me change the camera, please. Uh, I don't know where I want to go. There's like a zillion bajillion things to do. <laughs> it's a little, uh, it's a, it's a little lot. If I do that, I didn't make it, I didn't make it anywhere useful. But, I can do that, alright, and then I can switch the camera around. I can do like that, and go like, uh, and miss. Oh, I, I, you can do that. In fact, you just did do that. Congrats! <sighs> you. I know I touched you before. Okay, that was enough. I wasn't sure, but... The game is pretty generous, and yeah, there I can see, on top of the coach's head, there is indeed a purple. Very rude, whoever put it there. Now I have to give your beloved coach a concussion. It's not my responsibility, though. Playing nice! Playing nice! Alright, let's get things that are underwater. Uh, let's see here. And there's like a bunch of shells, too. They really want you to go past. Alright. Well, there's one right in over there, right there in the corner. There we go. Then you bop your head. That's how we do things. Give me that shell, please. No? Alright, never mind. I don't need that shell. Shut up. Alright, so there's you here. And then there's there. And I need to look around in my despair. Heal is still around, that can't be helped. Alright, I saw something purple, but yeah, it was a star bed. It wasn't money. What? There is money here, though. Am I going to touch it eventually? Sure looks like it. There's another one there. Alright, I should probably go back up. My meter is red. That typically means that, you know, you're kind of on the tail end of things. I understand how visual language works. Uh, okay, there's at least one more purple there in the water. Like, I just hope that I get most of it, because this feels like the most frightening thing to look around in for, maybe. Get out of here, fish. Right, doesn't look to be anything here. I'm almost halfway through my collection, and I'm kind of vaguely stuck underneath this overhang. It's fine. Anything in this, like, Sand drop zone here. Nope, alright. Here we go. Somewhere, of course. There's all these stages in the sky that we won't have to visit. So, can you long job while holding a shell? You sure can. I did it. I found that out. Alright. Time to rope time. That's right. So, now I'm gonna like, go like, whoa. Okay, look. I wanna get the ones on the bottom first. Here we go. Then we're just gonna... Yeah! Yeah, 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 yeah! Come on! Mario, let it fly! Here we go! Oh, well... I am not getting... Whoa! This would be fun. If you could have the... the arm strength... Oh, yeah! Here we go! Doing it! We be spinning! And I did spin. Alright, now we're going to use spring to go on top of the mountain. Check it out! I'm now trapped in a coil. There's that little guy I need to get still. Alright. Here we go. Trapped in a coil and getting wet. See, the bee makes sense. Like, you know, bees will be died by water. But I don't know why this coil is being stopped. Am I not getting a big bounce here? Like, why are you not giving me a big bounce? Is it because it's sand? How about on this rock? Oh, see, this rock, I'm getting a big bounce. But now I'm not anymore. What are the rules of big bounce? No, no, there is a timing component. It's not just... Uh, okay. Alright, I'm learning more that needs to be learned about big, big coiling. Good. All right, going right at the edge of everything here, almost falling, you know, because there's this one coin here. Fantastic! I knew it. I knew it. I knew it. I knew that was going to happen. I, I just knew. So why did I let it happen? Hubris? Honestly? Uh. 
No! No, 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 no! Can I save this? Maybe. It does not let me... Whatever. 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 This is one I can get without getting the spring, so let's just try and do this one real quick. Oh, is that how you're supposed to get to... Oh, I didn't do the swing set. Alright, 75. Yeah, I forgot how many I had when I fell into the void. Alright, so this time try not to fall into the rope, if you can help it. I did it, and I interrupted this penguin. Check out the sweet view. I did, probably, at some point. Don't worry about it. The sound you make is super cute. Alright, so maybe this is how you're supposed to get to these? I mean, it's a way to get to these. Just kind of hop from palm tree to palm tree, and then you fall, and then you hate yourself. What you need is not necessarily the ability to uh, jump high. I would love the ability to just kind of like slow down my fall. Alright, dude. Alright, okay, got you. Alright, might as well get on the cliff top. I think I'm pretty safe from falling anywhere. Okay, but obviously you're supposed to be keeping that due to that, like, string colonnade there. Oh boy. Yeah, mm -hmm. jumping on your head. Like a Mario would. Obviously. Yeah, and there's water, so, like, I can lose this. Gotta be careful. Alright, so, this is the backyard of this place. We don't go here very often. You know what, I should... This part needs you to be springing along. Might as well just do it now. Before it's too late. Cause like, I'm gonna need to go in the water, right? I mean, not necessarily. Looks like there's no spring in the water. This looks to be very specifically made to make you go close to the water and be afraid of the water. Now going into it. All right, nine more coins to get. And I can escape this nightmare. Uh, all right, so there's more over there, which I will go. There's near a fence, so it's pretty safe. Then we're gonna go to that upper echelon. I wanna see a spring and penguin, though. Why aren't I seeing any of that? All right, so, hey, penguin. Don't make fun of me, please. No, okay, well, you didn't even say anything. I think he is completely dumbfounded, and I don't blame him. Alright, well, um... Can I cancel out of this now? I can't even look around. Alright, there's none on top of there. There's the last three! Okay. The toppest part of the planetoid. Here we go. I got three lives. And look at that! This man was holding the Power Star all this time. Or at the very least, it was in close proximity, which close enough for me. Yeah, uh, man, see, this took a while, but I don't know. 
I feel bad just having done that today. Alright, let's see if anything pops up once we're back out into the greater world. Because there's another world here, right? Just Let's just take a look if the other big galaxy here, if its thing pops up. So apparently you can talk to that guy and I'll, I'll know like immediately. Alright, well I beachcombed. Uh, the galaxy was complete. I did it. Everyone is safe. Uh, hooray! Everyone do jumping jacks now. Of course, here's the map. Yeah, see, no, no pranksters have been summoned forth. I like the prankster system up until I specifically want to play prankster things. In which case, it becomes weirdly annoying. <laughs> yeah, 20 star bets. I'm gonna do it. I'm gonna, I'm gonna feed you. I'm gonna let you have it. It just happens automatically. I don't even need to fire myself. Um, sounds great. A snack a dilly do. Alright, let's finish the kitchen. Whoa, I'm in the kitchen. Unbelievable! I had to pay money to get this to appear here. So, where- what kind of purple is this going to be? Because I feel like the haunted house level has a lot less room to it to be able to just have a let you loose and get the thing. Purple coins in the bone pen. The bone- you know, where we hoard all our bones. Right here! In this complete Mysterion, what is this? Okay, so this is, well, this is where I had that race again, Space Ghost. I got a minute and I gotta get things going, huh? All right, and we're just, all right, we're just going right in. Okay, then. Okay, and there's giant bone meat. All right, here we go. Uh, da -da -da. Why help? Well, there's spike balls around. So I have no context for what would be an efficient way to gather, but, you know, I got a minute. I gotta get a hundred. For now, as you can see, I'm kind of throwing myself into lanes and kind of hoping for the best. Like I said, I don't know if that's a good strategy, but that's why you get health. It's because when you get bop by a spike, it's not like you just die, which is nice. Okay, see, well, shoot. See, I thought, okay, well, maybe if I can spin, I can get, like, some coins around me. That does not seem to be the case. Well, 10 seconds left. Okay, well, I'm gonna die from embarrassment, it looks like. No, maybe not. Whoa! Well, okay, does that still count in the timer? That still counts in the timer. So there are way more than enough coins here. Like... A ridiculous amount of coins. Wide areas. I I'm not gonna do it. I'm gonna die. I'm am not going to do it. That's is clear. Ah, <sighs> dude, whatever. Just, just just kill yourself. It's fine. Dying on a meat planet. I mean, it's right there. I can get it, maybe. Oh, dude, no, 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 no! Uh, I don't know why I'm bouncing around like that. Oh, no, I'm not gonna do it. I am not going to do it. Dude, dude. Yeah, trap by the meat.
Okay, so, I got a hundred. I got ten seconds. Eleven seconds, but I know basically ten to just get the star. There we go. Lucky meat bounce. Forget about it. It's all good. It's all good. Man! Again! Uh... Purple coin experience has been com- See, this- This was challenging, it was kind of hard, it was kind of annoying, but... At least it was interesting. It was like being like in a big pinball table with like, you know, like, 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 like boingings, like springs and, and bumpers. It was different and fun, and I appreciate that you're gonna have levels where it's just have like double the amount of coins. And just like get in there. I kind of wanted more of that. 